Hello everyone, in this video I am going to show you that how you can add tabs in your product description of the Shopify store. So this is in my debutify theme. So currently you can see that I have already implemented this feature which is like description, specification, policy. So here we have the image along with the text. We have also autoplay video which is uh, looping, I mean repeating over and over again. And we have description with some list of uh, things. So you can actually edit the things according to your requirement. You can also modify the color of uh, this or maybe also add the background color of this text so this is simple so let me show you step by step that how you can add into your store without knowing anything about the coding you don't need to learn coding for this and you don't need to install any extra app for this so you just follow the steps and then you will able to implement this in your store as well so let's uh, let's firstly go through uh, the dashboard. So here you can see that I have installed debutify 4.1.10.0. So this is the version which I have installed. So in future version or maybe older version, this will work definitely. If you still face any issue, then you can actually connect me. I will definitely help you out in that. All right. So let's remove the code first and then I will add it again uh, in front of you so that you get to know that how this is working. Click on actions, click on edit code. And now you will be redirected to uh, files and folders where you can actually add edit code. Here we have layout, we have templates. So click on layout, then we have theme.liquid and down below you need to find close head tag. All right. So just above this close head tag, I have already added this code which is related to CSS and JavaScript. I have removed that. And now if I will refresh this page again, you will no, no more able to see that uh, specific uh, design. I mean the design has been disappeared. Why? Because I have removed the code. So in the same way, let me show you the products. So here in the products page, you need to click on blenders for say example. So here uh, you need to click on show HTML. So here we have the uh, all code related to content. So let me remove this and let me save these changes. Now if I am clicking on preview, now you will see that we don't have any kind of description down below. All right. So that means description is disappeared because I have removed everything. Now let's move ahead with the steps which I have already added. So the step one is paste below code in product description. So I have to copy this. But before that, let me modify something. We have description, we have specification, we have policy. For example, I am interested to add one more tab which is like uh, for say example i am adding here tabs oh sorry terms all right then again you need to copy and paste this specific tag which is div tag and here we go all right so i need to paste it the whole div tag and here we have few things uh, for, but uh, let me delete everything and i am only going to add the single paragraph so this is related to terms all right and here you need to update term for, uh, tab 4 all right so in the same way you need to update here tab 4 all right let's save these changes let me copy this first step code and paste it into my product so here you need to make sure that uh, click on show HTML, then click paste it here. Let me save these changes. And once you are saving these changes, let's click on preview. So if you will see the preview, then you can see that we have description, specification, policy and terms. Now we need to add some code so that we could actually uh, make it more beautiful. All right. So here is the step second which is paste below code in theme.liquid just above close head tag so you need to copy this uh, this whole bunch of code and paste it just above the head tag all right so here is the head tag just paste it here let me save these changes and let's refresh this page again so now you will see that the design is looking beautiful but this is not in the tabs i mean tabs are not working all right, the whole list of uh, content is in a single tab, under the single tab. So let's add some more code, which is third step, 
paste below code in theme.liquid just above closed tag. So again, I need to copy this tag, uh, copy this these line of code, and just above head tag, I am going to paste it. Let me save these changes and let's refresh this page again. Now you will see that this is the description, this is specification, this is policy, this is terms. So the term text is this one. All right. And few important things are, uh, for example, you are interested to um, uh, change the image. So here you can see that this is the URL of the image. So you can actually upload your image and copy the URL and paste it here. And we have also the video URL. So you can upload your own video and replace the URL over here. So in that way, you can actually update anything you want it to. All right. So this is really simple. So if you are thinking this is uh, do you have any problem? So let me change this background color also. So here we will have some CSS code which is uh, related to this one. Yeah, this is. For example, I am adding here red. All right. So in the same way, I will have to add it here. For example, this is here, this one. For example, I am writing here red. So let me refresh this page again. Now you can see that this is looking red. All right. So now these tabs are also looking little different. So let's see how we can actually improve this one as well. So here we have some background color, which is active, hover, these are tabs. So for example, this is background, red. Let's see the changes. Sorry, this is not the right one. So maybe this one. So let's write here red. Let me refresh this page again. Now you can see that specification is now in different color. So these are the two things which we have actually modified and accordingly the background color has been updated. So if you are thinking that you need to update something else, you can connect me. I will definitely help you out. You can hire me as well because if you have any specific problem with the coding, so I am pretty much sure that I will definitely help you out with solving all those problems. So thank you once again. If you are still facing any issue, connect me. I have added the contact details below in the description. And and for this specific code, you can uh, find the link below in the description. Just download the code, implement it. And if you face problem, then ask me and let's get it done. Thank you once again. If you are new on this channel, then please subscribe this channel. Also like this video. Thank you once again. See you in the next video. Bye.